Hello and welcome to NBC News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnakar. The news in detail. Planting trees is the need of the hour. It is the largest oxygen providing plant. So celebrate the birthdays of the trees in much the same way as we celebrate the birthdays of children. Pay attention to the physical development of children as well as the development of trees. In a short one must take care of the trees and not shy away from responsibilities after planting them. Appealed Mayor Dayashankar Tiwari. In various spark in the Jaripatka area of the city, recently more than a thousand saplings were planted. The trees plantation campaign was inaugurated by Mayor Dayashankar Tiwari. He was speaking on the occasion. On the occasion, Virendra Kukreja, good key panchayat president Waliram Sharjamani, carpenter Mahendra Danviji, carpenter Pramila Mathrani, and other were present. The NMC is also on a mission to establish 75 health posts on the 75th Independence Day. Alcohol consumption attributes most cases of domestic conflicts which ultimately breed violence. Thus, in a bid to curb such incidents, Nagpur police will arrange special de-addiction camp for alcoholic men at their own expenses, said Commissioner of Police Amitesh Kumar. The top cop was speaking at the first of its kind grievances dressal camp addressing several complaints lodged with Parosa sale at Alankar Bhavan. Police headquarters here on Monday. Additional Commissioner of Police Sunil Kulare, Deputy Commissioner of Police Gajanan Rajman and staff of Barusa Sail were prominently present on this occasion. Kumar heard 83 complaints mostly related to domestic violence, harassment, child custody and cheating. Following the one-to-one -one interaction session with the complainants, the Commissioner of Police immediately directed Barusa Sail officials and councillors to take necessary conditions to resolve the respective issues. The restrictions imposed by administration tend to prove effective in the second capital of the state, Nagpur district, again reported zero COVID death and significant drop in fresh COVID-19 cases. A total 14 people tested positive on Monday, of which 11 patients were from the city and three from rural areas. In the day, a total 26 people successfully recovered from the virus part. This is taking the number of cumulative recovered to hold like 16,026. With the latest update, the total number of cases has surged to 477,209, while the number of deaths stands still at 9,031. In the day, 26 patients were successfully recovered from the virus bond disease, taking the number of total recovered patients at 468,026, following which the recovery rate has improved to 98.08%. After the fresh update, the total active cases in the city now stand at 152, including asymptomatic cases. Crime branch of Nagpur Police has arrested two pervert youth for kidnapping and raping a teenage girl. One of the accused has been posted the video of kidnapping on social media. He was seen abusing and thrashing the girl while riding on a two-wheeler. The arrest accused have been identified as Samir Khan, Samir Khan and Mohammed Sadiq, Mohammed Siddiq Shah. Samir Khan is the prime accused in the case. Shah is a property dealer and is a friend of Samir. According to police, the victim girl came in contact with Samir through a common friend in 2019. Love blossomed between the two and they regularly uploaded videos on TikTok. The accused Samir Khan allegedly promised the girl of marriage and took her to a lodge near Kunan where he sexually exploited the girl. The menace of roadmanship continues to take heavy toll as many as 102 persons lost their lives in a fatal road accident caused by trucks in Nagpur in the last 15 months. The statistics provided by traffic police in an RTI reply highlighted the need for immediate restrictions on the entry of heavy vehicles and the city limits. The query was posed by activist Abhay Kolarkar at the right to information. A total of 255 persons were killed in 1022 fatal road accidents from January 1st, 2020 to May 31st, 2021. Five persons were killed in 29 road accidents caused by persons. 51 died in 316 mishaps caused by cars, while 102 persons died in just 200 accidents caused by trucks. The statistics further shows that a higher number of fatalities occurred in the accidents caused by the trucks. Well, that's all from this bulletin. For more updates in and around the city, stay tuned within this and news. Till then, Ratnaka says goodbye. Please take very good care of yourself. Keep watching NBC News. Sajadi khai, pena chupai.